Hey there, I'm Connor and you're watching the Movavi Vlog, your go-to channel for creating cool videos. Today, I'm gonna explain what an outro is, what you need it for, and how to make one. But before we start, subscribe to our channel and hit that bell to get notified for any updates or challenges that we have coming up. Let's get started. Oh, also, we have a little surprise for anybody that watches till the end, so definitely stay tuned. We've showed you how to make an intro for a YouTube video, but this time we're gonna focus on an outro, which as you can kind of tell is the final part of the video. And here is where outros from other channels look like. There is a life I lead in this city. We need outros because it gives us the opportunity to use YouTube end screens. For example, a subscribe button or a preview for another video. The link to an episode on end screens is going to be here and in the description. There are plenty of variations of outros, like this one for example. It's not the best way to conclude your video or to add an end screen, it just covers up the character. And in some cases, they simply won't let you read the credits. So this is how not to do an outro. Here's a standard case. All clickable elements are visible and do not block any of the important bits of the video. And also the outro is uniform with the video and with the channel itself. We've had many different outros on our channel. They've changed as we've changed our taste or changed the style of our weekly videos or just started a brand new segment. Now we use bloopers for our outro and set up the end screen so that they don't cover up any of the video. Okay, I think that's enough theory, so let's get on to practice. If you already have an intro, then why not make your outro in the same style, like this. And I have to note that an outro can use either a photo or a video. It doesn't really matter, it's up to you. But what's important is that the end screens are framed correctly and don't really block anything. Very, very important. So today we're gonna make three outros. Let's take a still background from the Movavi effects store, the built-in Movavi collection, or even your own folder and place a call to action title right over it. We went for the background and the title Bandage One from the fitness set. You can add some frames, so don't worry about how to adjust your end screens. Here, you can find rectangles and circles to mark the positions of the subscribe button and video previews. And of course, you can change their opacity, color, outline thickness, and size. The outro like this is perfect when you need to set the subscribe button and a couple of video previews just like this. The second outro will be a simple video like this. Let's take a video clip. You can either find it in the built-in library of Movavi Video Editor or Movavi Effects Store. Add the title and frames that you need. To maintain the uniform style, we use the Pixel Age Pack, but don't forget that each clip has its own duration. And that means you can't just pull your clip's edges as if it were an image. You have to copy the clip a few times to make 20 seconds of an outro. Why 20 seconds, you ask? Well, check out our episode on end screens. The link will be in the video description. The third outro is hard to create, but it looks somewhat original. If you're good at drawing, feel free here to use your skills. Draw an outro that fits your channel's style. We're not artists whatsoever, and that's why we go for filming a special piece of footage. Do you remember the intro with Daria? So why not make an outro with Roman? We've taken some shots of Roman in front of the green screen. Let's open up Movavi Video Editor, select a background, and create one more video track to place the green screen clip on top of. Then we use the chroma key tool to remove the video background. Select the best take so that the splices between their copies won't be visible. Then we need to follow the same steps we followed before to make the outro one and two. Add the titles and frames. And there you go, you're done. I think it looks great, but do you agree? Let us know in the comments. Okay, since you made it to this moment, why don't we just give you a ready to use outro? 
The download link, much like all the Movavi effects that we used in this video, are going to be in the description, as usual. So go ahead, and if you want to create your own outro using the wonderful tips that we've given you, then feel free to share a link to that in the comment section below. Bye.